What's up everyone, it is Anthony from Mirrors of Adam and today, as you can see, I am not in my usual location. I am actually in Okayama, in a hotel, <laughs> but uh, that's not really important. What's important is, da -da, I got a thing, yeah, there is a bookstore not too far from the hotel, and I got this, I got the uh, King Oger, was this, is this Telebikun? Or Mook, Mook, this is a Mook, anyways, yeah, this is a Mook. Uh, that came with the Shoe God Soul for God uh, Kabuto. I was about to say Kuwagata, but this is Kabuto. Um, this is the green version. There is another version that we will be taking a look at it uh, here shortly. But uh, I guess because um, he's got kind of like two different modes, I guess. Um, if you've seen the most recent episode of King Oju, you would know. But if you haven't... Um, spoiler alert, I guess. Um, there's two kinds of, uh, two kinds of these souls. Well, not really. It's the same soul, but it turns in a different color. But, um, I guess in the green soul, or the, when it's green, um, that's when Kabuto is evil. That You see, you know, the Kabuto being evil in, like, previews and stuff. He's, you know, it's fighting, uh, the god Kuwagata. Um, but when he turns good, it's more of a gold color. Uh, which, again, we will be taking a look at very soon. But, um, yeah, this is fun. Yeah, just fun stuff in here. But, of course, the most important thing, da -da -da, we got the Shoe God Soul right here. We're going to open it up. Bam, right there. Very easy, very nice, very tiny little thing. Why did I care to get this? I don't know. Am I going to try to get the campaign item? Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. It's just a little plastic green gem with um, a mini god Kabuto inside. I don't know if you guys can see that, but oh, there it goes. I don't know if you guys... I don't know if you guys can see that, but bam. Yeah, it's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Not going to lie. That's that's nice. And then I'm here if you want to see the back... Bam. Like such. It has Bandai Namco on the back. Or no, it doesn't. It has it says China <laughs> on the back. Uh but yeah, they don't do anything with the roleplay items. They're just kind of a thing to I don't know, to keep. It's just something from the show, I guess. But anyways, what we're gonna do here, we're gonna switch to the computer here. So we are on the official Bandai Super Sentai toy information site. And here we go. We got some new shoe gods. Don't bother me. Listen, I know that <laughs> that these things have been out for a while or like we've known about these for a while. Official pictures, well not official pictures, leaked pictures I guess were released, I don't even know, maybe a week ago now? Maybe almost a week? I don't remember, but we got official pictures here on the Bandai Toy website. And we got a picture of the orangish um, emblem, or not emblem, the Shoe God Soul here. Let's take a look at it. Let's take a look at everything. So we got, uh, on April 22nd, the campaign to get this special Shoe God Soul uh, starts. So that's fun. You can reserve this early and guarantee yourself a Shoe God Soul. I should probably probably do that then i should probably do that <laughs> so i gotta go do that um because i do want this it's like you, you might as well get it right you know if you're gonna be buying the toys anyways you might as well get the campaign item because i'm gonna be buying these toys anyways and we're gonna take a look at the toys in a second but um just information about the campaign um and just keep in mind this is relevant to people in japan for those of you who are overseas and trying to get this campaign item, um, usually Amazon has a specific link that says, yes, this does come with the campaign item. Um, I know like Toe Collectible, I think Toe Collectibles, um, sometimes they have it, sometimes they don't. I think it says in the listing whether it has it or not, it comes with it or not. Um, places like HLJ or maybe some other secondhand retailers um, or middleman retailers, I should say, 
Um, they may or may not have it. I believe their listings usually usually say this may or may not have the campaign item. So just keep that in mind. Make sure you pay attention to the listing and make sure that it does come with the campaign item if that's something you care about. Because I do get a lot of comments in some of my videos saying, oh, yeah, I didn't get it. Like, I'm kind of sad I, I didn't get the campaign item. Well, like, yeah, just make sure to make sure you know whether or not um, it, it comes with it. So, for people in Japan, um, the reservation start date is March 25th. So that already passed. That's been like how many days already? <laughs> it is the 29th at the time of this recording here in Japan. Uh, bonus delivery released on the 22nd. The target product is the DX God Scorpion Sasuri, I believe. Is that Sasuri? Uh, DX God Hopper or Bata, right? The DX Large Shoe God set. So that's going to be the three auxiliary mech. We're going to take a look at that in a second. DX God Kabuto uh, by itself. It says release. What? That's released on April 22nd. New. That's that's not right because it's out already. By itself, it's out already. Oh, okay. Yeah, that that's a mistake. Um, DX King Oger and the DX King Oger God Kabuto set. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, here's the pretty boxes. We got ourselves uh, the Scorpion, the Bata, the three pack with Kabuto, Scorpion, and Bata. We got the Kabuto by itself. King Oger and King Oger with DX God Kabuto. Uh, make sure to check out that video if you haven't already. I did unbox that. That is, it's an absolutely beautiful mech. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay, here it says this is correct. DX God Scorpion and DX God Hopper scheduled to be released on the 22nd of April and DX God Kabuto released today. Okay, so that they, they fixed it there. All right. Well, whatever. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, this is the Legend King Oger. This is the combination of the King Oger, so the main 10 mech, as well as the Scorpion, no, the Scorpions over here, um, DX God Kabuto, and God uh, Bata. So, looks very nice. It looks very nice. Um, I really like the detailing here. I like all the, all the so much gold chrome. I love that. I love that. Like you got the shiny gold here and then you got the gold chrome here. Same with the rest. Like, dude, that's sick. I love that they're, <laughs> these, these things are popping out of his knees. Got the pink coming out of his knees. That's from Bata, I believe. That's cool. I love, this arm is absolutely crazy. And love the chest plate. This chest piece like kind of reminds me of, um, Omikoshi Phoenix on Donami Taijin. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. And then we got all the different combos there. We're going to be taking a look at each of them individually because they do have individual listings on this website. Um, so let's let's do that. Let's go to King Oger. Just in case anyone needs to see it again. Um, the DX God Kabuto is released already by itself. I don't know why it's released after the fact that it's already in the combo set with DX King Oger, whatever. We've talked about that already and I'm still confused. I don't understand that. But it's out already. If you didn't get the DX uh, God Kabuto when it was released with the DX King Oger, you can get it now for 300 or 3,850 yen here in Japan, March 25th release date, yada, yada, yada. But Actually, you could probably get it for less. I've seen retailers have for less. Band uh, retailers always have for less for the Bandai price, so that's a plus for me. For anyone who's <laughs> you know living in Japan, so that's great. So that's that. Or you can wait to get the DX God Kabuto um, when it is released again <laughs> in the three pack with Bata and Sasori. So. We're gonna take a look at the individual releases first. So we got DX God Hopper or God Bata, whatever you wanna call it. 
We got yeah. It, I I really like that the color schemes of all of these um, auxiliary mech are very similar. Um, definitely, really, it's really good because we're getting like this cohesiveness between the three, um, and it's also very relevant to the story in the show because these are like the treasures that um bug rock want to steal you know so that i like that i like that a lot and the gold just absolutely like it definitely gives it that treasury kind of vibe you know when you think treasure you think gold right so um and then black and gold is just a good color scheme all the time every time it's never a bad time um but i love this i love that they have like accenting colors too we got the pink here i love that i love that pink that's so nice um, okay, he's got the green eyes there. So this is the single release. Um, I'm sure it has a gimmick to it. I'm not sure what it is though. We'll take a look at it. Um, so this is the DX King Oger with only Bata. So what would it be called? DX King Oger Bata or DX Bata King Oger? I don't know. I don't remember the name. <laughs> What's it called? DX Hop King Oger. Probably Bata King Oger. Okay. That makes sense. Um, okay, so it's got like wings or whatever. There's yeah, so each of them have like some sort of functionality. Each of the auxiliary mech at least have some sort of functionality, which is like fantastic. <laughs> Definitely makes the price even more worth it. 2750 yen is what Bandai has it for, and it is released on April 22nd as well as the scorpion we got sasori very very dude this is sick similar color scheme to the well pretty much the same color scheme honestly as the other two auxiliary mech but this one has like this teal going on which is really nice so kabuto has like the green we just saw bata with the pink now sasori has this like blue light bluish tealish color very good i love this this is great so this is the sasori king oger i guess is what it's called um just the king oger with the scorpion on his arm that's sick that's crazy like look at all this like that's insane the chrome is super sick that chrome is nice just all the different golds that all these mech have fantastic so it looks like it's gonna have this functionality, some tail whip thing going on. <laughs> so that's fun. And there's another picture of the combo there. And here is the box for the single release. Looks very, very cool. So the information here, 300, or sorry, 3,850 yen. So the grasshopper is the least expensive of the fifth of the three it seems like and Sasori and Kabuto are pretty similar in price which is interesting um same release date and yeah very cool very very cool excited to get both of those and if you did not get Kabuto then you could get this three pack here we do have a three pack of all three of the auxiliary mech all of them look fantastic together very interesting color choices with the with the accenting colors. We got the green, pink, and blue. We got the three here. And we got all the three forms here. Kabuto, Bata, and Sasori. And we got Legend King Oger with all three of them on King Oger there. Very cool. I am excited to form this guy. This guy looks really, really good. And no, this is not going to be the final form of King Oger. This is... In the story, in the in the lore of King Oger, this is apparently like the true King Oger. Like this is the King Oger that stopped Bugna Rock. What was it? A thousand years ago or two thousand years ago or whatever? Like there's gonna be more bugs put on this thing. Cause I mean it's so early in the show. Why would why would they introduce the final mech ready? Uh but yeah, so there's that. And here's the beautiful box with all three of them. Very, very nice. I would have got this if I wasn't impatient and got the and got the the set with King Oger and God Kabuto. But you know, I I gotta have the toys right away. Like, listen, I gotta have these toys like right away. I can't be waiting on these because these are super super nice. 
love the King Ojo toy line so far. It's absolutely fantastic. So if you want to get this, it is 10,450 yen here in Japan. And we have a release date of the same, April 22nd. So that I think, good, I'm so glad this makes sense. Like how I would have been mad if this came out first and then the two single releases. So like I said, if you buy um, any of these, like any of these uh, toys or DX King Oger or DX King Oger and God Kabuto set or the single release of DX God Kabuto, then you have a chance of getting that special shoe god soul right here. Um, if you're in Japan, try to reserve your toys um, just so that you can be guaranteed to get this if you so desire. Go, you can go to pretty much anywhere you can reserve it, I think. Um, I usually reserve it at Toys R Us because they make it so easy to, re to reserve. Um, I'm not sure about other places though, so make sure you subscribe to the channel. Follow us on our social media down the below. We also have a Discord, so make sure to flex your toys, collectibles, all that good stuff, and we'll see you all next time.